out if you know yes. at least get, you know open the window if you can uh, or step outside for from the office for five minutes even it would do you some good the sunshine feels great right it does. and uh, you know I feel like you're a ray of sunshine too Lindsay look at you beautiful in the orange <laughs> today we're getting so close to fall right you know feeling more like September finally and stretch of lower humidity lots of sunny days are ahead of us and we've got temperatures out there in the upper 70s this afternoon which is near normal for this time of the year we should be in those low 80s to upper 70s over the course of the next week though as we get closer to fall we should be down into the upper 70s for those highs and we've got 60s for you this evening becoming more mild winds generally out of the north and northeast today it's still a dry pattern we have lower dew points behind that front and we do cool down quickly for the foothills late evening overnight you're going to be back into the 50s too a lot of 50s early this morning in the mountains a few 40s we'll expect to see similar conditions tomorrow but pretty comfy for you this afternoon near 72 if we can even get you to 72 those western slopes you're going to be cooler today we've got you in the mid to upper 60s and you're still sitting in the 50s in a few spots like Beach Mountain, but you're at 51 through late evening and chilly, but with a light breeze early morning you may keep temperatures just near 50 degrees to upper 40. So hopefully not too chilly for you there, but it is the kind of layering up weather. We have to have those jackets ready in the back of the car. At least I have them ready for my kids most of the time. I don't always know where my umbrella is, but I know where those jackets are as we get cooler in the season. 71 degrees in North Wilkesboro right now. You are at 70 in Martinsville, 75 at Caswell Game Lands. You know, in the sunshine, it does feel even warmer, about 10 degrees warmer if you have to work outside. So you still feel like more like the 80s if you have to be working in the sunshine. Nice, though, to be backed off from the steamy conditions. We've got clouds off the coast. This is the front that helped us out. Does look like it's going to stay east of us and so not bring in that coastal low threat, which could bring in some shower chances this weekend. Looks dry instead. We are now monitoring a new system. This is Tropical Depression 7. You can see it here sneaking in on the corner of your screen here as it moves out toward the Leeward Islands for the weekend from Guadalupe impacted there with heavy rains, showers and storms likely as tropical storm Fiona. That's right. That's next on our list and it tracks out over areas of Puerto Rico, the US Virgin Islands. So if you have any travel plans over the next five days, be aware by Monday we're going to see this passing toward the Dominican Republic and then heading out toward areas of Cuba and on that eastern on the eastern slopes where some of the heavier rains may fall here uh, for the Dominican Republic all the way up north through the Orlando area. Folks will be monitoring this through Miami too as it may impact the southeast coast for the triad though a non impact at the moment. We're going to see where this track does take it. You can see 70s for you by high school football evening later this week. We stay mostly dry. We're still seeing nice evening conditions, but I think it's blankets in the stands kind of weather and for certainly for football. Yeah, feeling good. We've got upper 70s for your Wednesday to low 80s and we do see a slight increase in temperature each day by Sunday though even warmer. So we do know that we're getting up there. We see a ridge of high pressure aloft and that's going to keep us much warmer. And even the mountains will have a chance to warm. But for now, low 70s to near 74 by Saturday. Overnight lows back and forth with those upper 40s to low 50s. Look at the seven day forecast. Warmer by Sunday at 86 and upper 80s Monday and Tuesday. Just a fantastic looking stretch. Well, America's